Hello. Welcome to putting on a little bit better face with me, Face Angel. <laughs> you can call me Auntie Angel. I, hey, look, I got some new eyeliner slash eyebrow stuff because look how little mine got. And I found some. Yay! That's the kind of low budget I've been on. <laughs> anyway, uh, I thought I would share with you the rapid transformation that a little bit of color will do on an old lady's face while I share my thoughts for the day. I just finished, what did I do? I uh, reseated a toilet. That's not something I do every day. I'm definitely not an expert. And, but I have done it a couple times now, so I'm, I'm probably more of an expert than most of you. <laughs> and, mm, I didn't have time to, I had to, I had to re-cement something in the screws, the anchor screws. I didn't really have time. I don't know what's going on with my face here. Ow. And, uh, that's not good. Anyway, so, I didn't have time to cure and I'm hoping Hoping that it works out okay. Man, my face is doing something unpleasant with the skin. It's part of the whole aging thing that does happen. I'm going to not mess with it and go put some stuff on it. Some other stuff. Some medicinal type of stuff. But for now, I'm going to finish the transformation. I like to point out uh, it's all relative. And there's not one way. And I'm not looking for perfection. I'm just looking for a little bit better. A little bit better face. I like to do it for other people and for myself, actually, when I look at myself in the mirror. It is nice to be a little less shocked <laughs> sometimes. Mm -hmm. New stuff. I'm going to have to have to get around with these. Hmm. <laughs> I'm not going to take the tweezers to my eyebrows today because I did it yesterday and I don't know what's going on with my skin, but I'm going to just disturb it as little as possible. Let it heal. I got some female hormonal stuff going on, which always makes everything a little more sensitive. So that's probably what it is. I got some dinner in the oven for myself. I'm gonna have cod and Brussels sprouts and leftover rice. I got a little out of hand there. It's all right. I was saying in one of my other videos, when I was a kid, I used to criticize older folks like I am now for putting on their makeup crooked. And now I realize, oh, you're lucky if you get any in the vicinity at all because <laughs> the hands shake the eyes are fuzzy it's a lot going on the skin is wrinkly anyway you do the best you can with what you got and that's enough uh-huh you're enough and i'm enough whether we put on a better face or not but you don't have to put on a better face to feel better but it effing helps. <laughs> uh-huh. I have a little, it's a little inside joke, a little running list of things that I could put in a book called, a, you don't have to blank, but it effing helps. Started from, uh, you don't have to wear running shoes to run, but it fucking helps. I don't know why I was saying effing. Like you were a kid. <laughs> Maybe you are. I also bought a brand new eyeliner. I'm a little a little nervous to use. A new kind. They got they're always coming out with new kinds. Uh oh. Oh man. I bought the wrong one. How does that even work? I only use black. I thought I'd triple checked, but look, it says right there, gray grease. That'll be 
you see it's gray. That's just one of those things. I'm going to try it anyway. Because I'm curious and I just paid like $10 for it. So might as well. Who knows? Maybe I like the gray. I think I like black. But I'll make do with gray since that's what I got. It does go on nice, but I can't. If it's how it would look if it was dark enough, because it's not. Huh. That helps a little. Better nothing. That's the point. Mm hmm. I'm smelling my dinner. I got garlic on it too. Fresh garlic cooking up. Yeah. Gray is not my favorite at all, but that was my silly mistake. Try not to make that kind of mistakes anymore, but they do do seem to happen more and more. It's the brain, the body and the brain not working as well as they used to. It's a, they ain't lying about all that being a bitch stuff. I should have done this before I did the mascara, but you know, I like to go backwards sometimes. Mm hmm. Yep, pretty far from perfect, but better than it was. That's the point. This kind of eyeliner I've been using since I was like 12 years old was that 40 years. And it's only doubled or tripled in price since then. Not, it did double in price almost in the last couple years, actually, like everything. But before that, it was the same price for a really long time. Or close to it, you know, eking up. I guess relatively we've enjoyed that. On a lot of things, haven't we? Mm-hmm. All right. I'd say that's just a little bit better, which is what I was aiming for. Just a little bit better. Mm-hmm. I know this is a weird video. I've got lots of weird videos of all sorts of things. One of the things I'm doing lately is a stock photography journey, seeing if I can make some cash. Another thing I do is uh, alternative construction, paper crate. I also do some beginner yoga stuff, strengthening and stretching. So, uh, and then some musical stuff. So if you're interested, give me a thumbs up, subscribe or subscribe. If you like this, give me a thumbs up. <sighs> Mostly stay curious, stay courageous and stay free.